Hi everyone today i want to discuss about the carbides we know some carbides example aluminum carbide beryllium carbide calcium carbide magnesium carbide and somewhat it is difficult to write their formula because different carbides are there so which i am having the what is the charge that is we don't know that's why it is difficult to write the formula so i want to make it is easy today so now we have the ion common name systematic name so first carbide is c minus 4 its common name is carbide or methanide systematic name is carbide example for this carbide is aluminum carbide this is aluminum carbide then how this formula formed because of this is aluminum plus 3 charge carbide minus 4 charge criss cross method we will get aluminum carbide on hydrolysis of this aluminum carbide we will get this is a product aluminum carbide on hydrolysis it gives aluminum hydroxide and methane so this methane is nearly 3 moles according to balanced equation this is called methane now the second type carbide is C to power minus two, and its common name is acetylide. Systematic name is dicarbide minus two. One of the example for this acetylide is calcium carbide. On hydrolysis, it gives ethane. on hydrolysis it gives a ethane that reaction is given here hydrolysis this is called calcium carbide on hydrolysis it produces the calcium hydroxide and acetylene that is a common name a upac name is a ethane how this calcium carbide formula formed it is calcium having positively charged carbide having negatively charged with their plus 2 minus 2 charge this is calcium plus 2 and carbide minus 2 according to criss cross method we will get this is a formula then calcium 2 carbide taken twice 2 ones are 2 ones are cancel therefore we will get the formula ca c2 if you don't want one mean you can directly write this is calcium carbide ca c2 so this is a way how to write the its formula the another another type of carbide is c3 power minus 4 it's there is no common name we have only systematic name the systematic name is tricarbide minus 4 and one of the example for this c3 minus 4 is magnesium carbide what is the example for this magnesium carbide then how this magnesium carbide formula is formed we know that magnesium plus 2 and now only we know that this carbide is c3 minus 4 then this can be taken as like this mg plus 2 c3 minus 4 according to criss cross we will get this is mg 4 c3 taken twice then 2 ones are 2 two twos are therefore mg 2 you will get mg2c3 
on hydrolysis this magnesium carbide gives propyne this is a magnesium carbide and produce the its name called propyne so i hope you understood different types of carbide with the how to write their formula and what are their hydrolysis product and their systematic and common names now all together i given at one place this is called their respective carbide formula their common name and systematic name example major hydrolysis product first one carbide that is called methanoid or carbide IUPAC name or systematic name is carbide example aluminium carbide or beryllium carbide also you can write it produce the methane therefore this aluminium carbide also known as methanide now this is another carbide c2 2 minus acetylide dicarbide 2 minus is a iupac name or systematic name its example is a calcium carbide and the hydrolysis product is a ethane therefore this calcium carbide also known as ethanide or acetylide next one common another ion is c3 4 minus its IUPAC name is a tricarbide 4 minus magnesium carbide is the example what is this a indicating here only one carbide is that is known that is magnesium carbide only and this is propyne 